Appearing at her first news conference in several weeks, this is how the governor summed up this latest COVID surge. We are in the eye of the, of the most horrendous storm. And in that situation, we need to just all rally together and be united on this. The governor described an alarming new trend in which multiple people have been brought to the hospitals dead on arrival. GMH Medical Director Dr. Jolene Uggen says she believes the victims might have suffered from silent epoxia. One of the biggest advice that I give for the community is if you are testing positive for COVID, that you purchase a pulse oximeter. Because this pulse oximeter at days five and on from your exposure is something that needs to be checked several times during the day because you will not know that your oxygen levels are that low. And, I, and that's what I think is contributing to these dead on arrivals. Dr. Uggen says if you register less than a 95 on the oximeter, you need to get to the hospital for treatment. Meanwhile, despite the new trend and the multi-week surge, the governor says she believes the current measures are providing enough protection, although they have talked about other options. We have discussed lockdowns. We are looking at what we can do to help, maybe not a total lockdown, but maybe some other restrictions. But the repeated message from the governor and health officials was to get vaccinated. It is the fact that at the hospitals, the severity of the illness is not seen with vaccinated patients. You hurt their senses. And that most of the people that are in ICU are not vaccinated. Most of the people that are on the ventilators are not vaccinated. We're seeing dead on arrivals that are not vaccinated. And we've seen longer duration of hospital cases not vaccinated. The governor says they're even ahead of President Biden's just announced six-step plan for fighting the virus, including more rapid testing and monoclonal treatment to head off the disease before it requires hospitalization. But she also urges the community to stick to the basics of what has worked before. Wear your mask, watch your distance, wash your hands, and get vaccinated. For Guam's News Network, I'm Nestor Lacanto. Thank you, Governor.